So, as a lot of you know, I was gone the last couple of days traveling to Texas actually to visit the Tribe Pro Team and just kind of hang out at the Content House, all that good stuff, just to sort of like get out of the house because it's been a long time since I've done anything. So we just did like a spontaneous trip, hung out with Hawk's Nest as we sort of passed him in subscribers, so it was like a fun time. Um, but in that time that I was gone, on Thursday we had the brand new ASM 10 Lucky Draw release for the new Legendary. And I had no idea. I assumed it was a redux this week because of the fact that I had seen no YouTube videos posted on it for whatever reason. I had actually checked it out a little bit here before starting the recording. And this is a super, super cool looking skin. Kind of reminds me of the Space Station Cordite. I know, I don't know why that's off center. I know it doesn't have the same like coloring or look, but just like with that little floating, I don't even know if you want to call that an eye or something and the general coloring and like geometry of the gun, it really does remind me of that. So this looks like a really dope skin. Obviously it's gonna have custom iron sights, reactive forms and a kill effect. So it should be fun. I've got 8,500 CP. Not sure if that's gonna be enough to do the whole draw, um, but obviously if we get the ASM, we'll stop there. Even though I think this firebreak skin that's coming in this lucky draw is extremely cool as well. Actually, I, I like this entire draw. I don't know if it's just like the, the coloring, the geometry, or like the entire theme of it, but it really does just give me like futuristic vibes. The KRM here, it doesn't look like it's going to have any custom iron sights, but uh, it's just cool to see an extra epic KRM skin, and that will give us an excuse to use this weapon sometime here in the new future. Really, again, like the coloring of that. We've got the drone assist emote, so that's pretty dope. And yeah, like I said, I just pretty much like everything about this draw besides like the BR stuff just because I'm not too much of a BR player. But we'll go ahead and start spinning here on this. And for our first pull with 30, we're going to be getting just the throwaway uh, profile picture. Is that even what? Oh, we haven't seen a profile picture in forever, have we? That's kind of weird. Next up, we got the 50 GS. Go ahead and clean that up. Waterproof. Is that the name of it? Okay. And this is the Desperado class... I guess turret. I actually assumed this was going to be a sentry turret skin in the multiplayer, but either or, you know, we'll go ahead and clean that up. Probably won't use it too much since it is a BR item. For a third spin, we're actually going to be getting the firebreak skin. Okay, so if I wasn't going for the gun specifically, that would have been insane luck. I feel like I say that a lot. I've been getting the character skins a lot more commonly lately, but I think COD Mobile just knows that I'm always after the legendary uh, skin itself. So that's not going to be a big deal and that's not going to stop us from spending money. Next up, drone assist emote. 800 CP here. That's going to start costing us. This is our, what, sixth draw, right? We got ourselves the cargo truck. So our seventh pull is going to be 1300 CP. We'll probably get the calling card, I'd assume. No, we'll get the KRM. Okay, I'll take that. Number eight, 2000 CP. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have enough for this entire draw. We'll probably have to top up. We got the quick escape calling card. And this is our ninth one for 2800. We got the axe, so we'll go ahead and collect that, and it looks like we're gonna be shy just about 4,000 CP, so time to stack up. And since we just dropped $100 on the game, I think this is a perfect time for us to mention that today's video is sponsored by Call of Duty Mobile, so huge shout out to them for partnering with the channel on today's video and making this possible, and obviously COD Mobile wouldn't reach out about sponsorships if it wasn't for you guys, so I appreciate you guys always for supporting the videos and making this entire video just, you know, what I'm doing possible. With that being said, Time for us to keep spending money and purchase this ASM-10, picking it up there in our final spin. Not hearing any audio for it, which is kind of interesting, but uh, yeah, there it is. Do I even make an attempt at pronouncing the name of this? Absol Agent, is that what it's called? Regardless, I think it's sick. Can't wait to see the iron sights for it. Let's go ahead and build a loadout. I'm actually gonna go to YouTube here and uh, go to my most recent ASM video because that loadout shred. Okay, so that's the loadout we actually have here on screen. So let's go ahead and go to the new legendary and just kind of check out the build in general. So this is a super high mobility, like default blueprint, which is actually not horrible. But again, we're gonna go ahead and just swap it up to the one that I had used before because that thing was insane. Shout out to that Noah from YouTube dude, always labeling his videos with like markers so you can go exactly to the gunsmith whenever you need on a video. And just to quickly go over the stats real fast, you can see the accuracy is up, the mobility is up, and the range is up. So this increases your speed as well as your bullet spread accuracy and ability to three shot at range. And the only downside of this build is gonna be to the controls, but if I remember properly, it's only gonna be the vertical recoil that's increased which is simple, which is super easy to control. All you have to do is just move your thumb down, so that shouldn't be too much of a problem. So yeah, with all that being said, we're gonna go ahead and start queuing up into some ranked matches, and I'll see you all once I find a game. Ooh, actually, quickly before we do that, I did want to mention that you sort of need to run toughness with this build 
just because that nose stock is going to increase your hit flinch by 20 percent so with toughness i believe it decreases yes yeah, 60 percent so it evens out and actually helps even further and i think that was like the only important thing to mention here in this build because if you don't use toughness you're gonna have a lot of struggles with the controls but with the perk equipped, it's a beam. All right, so for our first matchup, we actually found ourselves a team deathmatch on Dome, death which match. I'm super excited about because as a lot of you guys know, this is one of my favorite maps in all of COD history. Two, I had actually warmed up with this weapon in a couple of free-for-alls, and this thing might be my new favorite legendary. It's got a lot of really cool features, and just listen to this audio effect. I'm gonna go ahead and mute the music, mute my voice, listen. That like, I don't know like pulsing sound of the gun it just sounds so satisfying so nice on top of that this sort of reminds me of like a valorant skin sort of like a vandal thing so i don't know this thing looks sick absolutely slaps as i'd mentioned heard that guy from a mile away good to be back on my own headset i'm excited it's gonna be fun probably have some enemies spawning behind us over here in this building i'm actually gonna push it here i'd imagine they're gonna be in the hallway in a second yeah there's one ah oh, thermite on me okay we're good we're good and I imagine they're going to be at the bunker. Yeah, yeah, I think I just saw the one that threw the trip on at me or whatever it was. Thermite. Go ahead and pop up this UAV. Got one close. There we go. Everybody in the chat's debating whether or not I'm the real one. Yes, sir. Meanwhile, we're still streaking up. A oh, nice little six. I saw a guy at the bunker. Go ahead and avoid them for now. I'll drop the sentry gun right here just in case those players try to flank me. Ooh, actually, super shocked that I lived right there. Got players of the vehicles. Okay, dope. Sentry's actually picking up one there. I imagine they're going to be back around over here. Let me go ahead and throw a trip mine around the corner. Oh, I hear one coming. Let's see if the trip mine cleans it up. Oh, I think he shot it. Yeah, he shot it down. Come on, bro. The sentry gun's putting in work. I hear more in the hallway. Go ahead and get a nice little angle on that. Take them down. Throw up the UAV. Probably have another one coming here in a second. Yeah, dude saw me. There's gonna be another one in the back. Let's see. There we go. Okay. That dude spawned right on me. Still have more near. Let's go ahead and finish the reload. We got two in front. Uh, I'm gonna have to use the shield to get out of this. Perfect. Perfectly executed. Is there another one? Oh, yeah, there is. Dope. Drop that sentry just in case they decide to keep pushing. We're putting in work, bro. Oh, no, I got the advance. As soon as I went to go call it in, there's a player right in front of me. It's definitely a 20 bomb gameplay right here. Got a player right by these boxes. And there we go. It's a 20 bomb. Keep it going. It's 21. Oh, we got some more players mid. Go ahead and push them. Take out one. Get the other. Yeah, I love this thing. The iron sights as well. Like everything about the skin cosmetically and the way it performs, it sounds so like super appealing for me, pleasing. GG's we lost. That was a guy typing. Nice. Take advantage of that. GG's, man. I love the ASM, man. All right, we got somebody here for game number two. Should be a perfect map for the three taps. Again, I'm surprised that I didn't see any other YouTubers covering this weapon when it came out, just because this thing is like super cool. I don't know. I love it a lot. Got that player kind of weak. Get a little ghost touch on my ADS button. I know he's sniping, so I'm just gonna go ahead and push up. We got some players below us as well. I'm gonna try to push around this way. Nice. That dude was holding an angle with the shorty. Absolute psycho. Is this guy up top? Yeah, yeah, he is. Should be on a flank. Two. Wait, oh, shoot. Yeah, there's a lot. Gotta get out of here. Okay, that guy, I don't think he actually saw me drop. Well, I'm dead. Unless this guy didn't see me walk by him. There's a possibility. Oh no, he saw me. Just lucked out. Go ahead and fall back. Get this reload down. It's pretty important that we get more ammo. We're just gonna chill here for a second. There might be a player that drops down on my head. Oh nice. Teammates actually just flipped the spawns for me. You know what? I'm gonna sit right here. Oh yeah, I also forgot to mention we threw on the Hawk X just because I haven't used that thing in forever. Should be a lot of fun. There we go, we got the Hawk X. Calling the hawk here in just a second once we flip the spawn points. Oh, RIP teammate. Oh, this one's not playing. Okay, but well, you know what? Game plan, we'll go ahead and take out that player. And we'll call on the hawk right over here. We'll go like right down here. Yeah. Okay, we gotta fly across the map pretty quickly here. Honestly, they might start spawning directly on me. I wouldn't be surprised. 
This thing's actually still pretty nasty. Oh, we got the advanced. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and see if we can get a couple more kills with this thing. Our team is absolutely destroying, by the way. And then we'll call in the advance. Okay, my aim's amazing. I know. It should still be spawning down here, right? Yep, I see two. Come on, take out that one. Dude, just run circles around me. Oh, I think he knifed my Hawkeyes. I'm gonna go ahead and pop the advance. Got player green, looping all the way around. Oh, he's got the sight. Yeah, that's not my challenge. Not winning that fight. Go ahead and just take out this player. Swap to the shorty real fast. This player climbing up. Oh, I didn't think that guy was pushing me. I feel like they're still all up top. Okay, just dead to the dog. Oh my gosh. All right, game number three, we got Nuketown. Let's get it. Okay, so enemies grabbed full map control off the start of the match. I'm gonna assume that blue dude was my teammate. That player's over there. Okay, let me go ahead and throw that down. We're starting to like clear him out a little bit. Try to help out. Huge kill there. Yeah, if I can control this building. Or, um, what is a car? Just one more. Hmm. Okay, we're chilling. Throw up the UAV. Drop the shock RC. And then a trophy system, and I'm posted up on this vehicle. Enemies aren't gonna be able to get by me. Mm hmm. Throw those thermites, brother. Throw those thermites. Actually, gonna move up a little bit, drop the shield. Now we're posted up on this instead. Let's see if this guy's pushing me. Uh, teammates are on him. Thing about Nuketown is it's such a like half control sided map. Like if you have the control of the halfway more than any other map, it's deadly. So there's one more player like right here. Yes. That's about to be like campy gameplay for sure. I'm gonna try to actually push up here. Okay, I'm advanced. Mm. See this guy's chasing me. Friendly shock RC. Friendly shock RC. Playing the garage here. Oh, that dude ego chowed me. This is actually a really tight game right now. I'm gonna try to push up. Mm, spotted the one on the vehicle there. Okay, we're good. Drop this so I have that down for extra support. Got your teammate. Got that shock car. Let's see if we can hit another reload. Go ahead and push up the shoddy. Nice. One more. GG's. There we go. 23 kill game. And everyone, that will do it here for today's video. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. If y'all did enjoy, I'd appreciate if you went ahead and dropped a like rating on the video. Feel free to hit that subscribe button as well if you're enjoying the content we've been posting here on the channel recently and you just enjoy Call of Duty Mobile content. And just to mention it, once again, I'm finally back home, so the regular upload schedule is going to start happening again. As a lot of you guys know, I was traveling the last couple of days, so I just wasn't home to post or stream, but all that's resuming starting today, so... With all that being said, stand on the lookout for more content. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll do it here for myself, and I'll catch you all in the next one.